Asthma is a significant noncommunicable disease with high morbidity and mortality in severe cases. Childhood asthma has higher incidence and prevalence than adult asthma, but the opposite is true for morbidity and mortality. Boys are more common in childhood asthma while women are more common in adult asthma. The global epidemic of asthma continues, especially in low to middle income countries. Asthma is a heterogeneous disease with distinct phenotypes and endotypes that need to be adequately characterized for research and clinical settings. New clustering techniques such as latent class analysis and computational phenotyping methods are being developed to assist in early diagnosis of asthma. Environmental determinants that trigger asthma are well established, but more work is needed to define their role in the development of asthma. Investigation into gene-by-environment and environment-by-environment -environment interactions may help identify high-risk groups and key modifiable exposures. Asthma can impair airway development and reduce maximally attained lung function in children, which may persist into adulthood without additional progressive loss. Adult asthma can accelerate lung function decline and increase the risk of fixed airflow obstruction, with early-onset asthma having a greater effect than late-onset asthma. Therefore, managing asthma should focus on improving long-term respiratory and other health outcomes in addition to short-term symptoms. This article was authored by Shemily C. Vermich, Jennifer L. Perret, Jennifer L. Perret, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.